There are many ways to trust a chicken. Now, and I'm making a point of saying trusting, not trusting, because remember, you can never trust a chicken, but you can trust them. I have a beautiful chicken here. This is uh, courtesy of our friends over at Cole Foods, a uh, pastured chicken, not free range, one step better, it's pastured, which means it lives out in the pasture, enjoying life, eating nice uh, the things that they're supposed to eat, little buggies and stuff like that. All the stuff the chickens are meant to eat, this guy's eating. No growth hormones, no antibiotics, of course, and 100% uh, natural. Now, we're gonna take a bunch of butcher's twine. Take more than you think you need, because you can always cut off the excess, okay? Put this aside. now. I looked online, there's probably 50 different videos out there and articles telling you the best way, the perfect way, the absolute, the ultimate way. Pay no attention to perfect and ultimate. There is no perfect and ultimate in pretty much anything, okay? You wanna do the way that works for you. I'm gonna show you a way that works for me. You could disagree. And if you do disagree, do it your way. I'm not offended, okay? Not at all. Right, the first thing I like to do is you want to remember to keep things close to the body. So I'm just going to take right here, even out our string, it goes right underneath the wings, right underneath the breast, and I'm going to cross it and then cross it again and pull it. Now, I like to do this because I like the, the wings close to the breast to get a little bit extra color on them. Okay, when you fold them underneath to me, you're just letting it sit there and you know, wings with crispy skin. You're talking good eating, okay? So we got that going now. So now we're gonna go underneath the, the bird one time, okay? And we're gonna take our legs right up here. Again, cross the strings. So we pull the legs together. Go under one, two times, just like that. The reason we're going over under twice is so that when you cinch it together, it stays there, okay? Now, I got the little, uh, what my aunt used to call, the part that went over the fence last, hanging out. If you want, tuck it in, okay? In other words, we want to tuck the, you want to tuck the tush in on the chicken. All we got to do now is take this, tie it off. One, you can tie it in a nice little bow if you want like tying your shoes, and there we go. A nice trust chicken, okay? Not trusted, but trust, okay? And I like to pull the uh, meat, uh, the skin rather, of the breast right over there. So until next time, enjoy, happy eating, and l'chaim.